Okay, now we're at the final part of the game, and we want to just uh, figure out a way for the game to end. I mean, right now, it, this is a game that will just go on forever. There's really no point to this game. And the point to the game here, let me just stop it and start it again to show you. Okay, again, starting right there. The point of the game is that you need to always have the ball hit the paddle up, and it misses the paddle and hits the, the ground, this blue area. Remember, at the very beginning, we created this so we had the ball, the green ball, the red paddle, and that blue line at the bottom. Um, so that blue line at the bottom is what we're going to focus on right now. We're still in the ball sprite script area, and we're going to go up to control because this is about what happens with the ball, what happens to the ball. So we're going to click when clicked, and we're going to go back to our forever if. This is a conditional statement. If something happens, and in this case, we want it to sense something, so we want it to sense the ball touching. Let me grab touching. Touching what? Touching the you lose area. So we're going to select that. And if it touches the you lose area, we'll go here to looks. We want it to say something. And we're going to grab the say hello and drop it down here. And obviously, it's not going to say hello. We want it to say something else. So we're going to say, you lose. And what happens after that? Well, you lose, but we need for it to, uh, to uh, do something else. Because right now, if we, if we just go and play it that way, watch what happens. OK? The ball just kind of flies around saying, you lose. And that's not exactly what we want to happen. We want the game to end. So there's one more thing that we have to add. And that's going back up to the control. And it's down here. Notice there's a, a, scroll, a scroll bar. Stop all. It's the very last one. And we're going to drop it. Oops, come on. Let's go. We're going to drop it right under you lose. So notice what happens now when I play. And I bounce. And if I'm clumsy, bam, you lose. And that's it. It stops and it says you lose. And that's pretty much the end of the game. And so you can restart the game. And there we go. Everything's wonderful. OK, so this is the whole extent of the game. This is where uh, your grade comes in. Um, as far as the, uh, the message here, the you lose message, I'd like you to just keep it at that. I don't want to see anything inappropriate. And. Uh, when you're done with that, for extra credit, uh, save it as you know Pong Advanced or Pong Plus or something like that, and try to make something uh, different. We'll talk a little bit about that uh, um, after this. I'll show you some uh, some other possibilities, and we can discuss other possibilities for um, improving this Pong game to make it more interesting and maybe maybe a little bit more challenging. So. Uh, let's go, you know, uh, when, when we get to the lab, I just have some fun and put it together.